jump scare. Gotcha. So, hey everyone, good tonight here. Greetings, noble viewer. And, uh, Airsoft Weekend Warriors. <laughs> so, uh, today we're talking about the throat mic. So, the throat mic's older piece of gear, more like 1980s sort of setup, but as you can see, I can talk in a very low, almost raspy whisper, and you'll get stuff received on the other end. So, useful device, what, like 1980, whatnot. First learned about it when I was a wee lad, Police Quest SWAT, never got a chance to play with it when I was younger because, well, the internet was garbage and ordering things was a pain. So here we have my little setup with the listen to glove and PTT on the shoulder. And that's really all you need is the PTT and the uh, throw mic. Throw mics have these two pickups, one's in the back where it's not supposed to be. Where you want them is on the sides of your larynx, your voice box, so you can pick up those small vibrations and transmit them over radio. But only one of them really fits. It's old technology, but as you can see, it works. You can whisper in a low voice. You can talk roughly about it at this level. And it'll still pick up. Just like this. So if you're really listening, you got it on nicely, you'll be able to pick up everything. And I was talking a bit louder over there so you guys can actually hear it, but it comes across. It's a little bit more whispery and not as clear, which depending on how far apart you are from your teammates and how tall your antennas are and all that quality stuff could be an issue, but mm, excuse me, ultimately a cool little device. I just want to talk to you guys about it because we don't really I, I like I said, it's dated now we've all got contacts and boom mics and sword ends and we're running around screaming into our microphones, having a good time but if you're doing more like dedicated infiltration stealth work and you're sneaking around particularly I'd say even more so airsoft sniper wise where you want to be able to communicate with your team but not let the enemy know where you are these can still be pretty useful or if you're leading a breaching team assault and you got your main guy doing the support leadership role being like you guys ready to breach that door and you're like standing by the threats ready to live by your order it, it's it's pretty cool stuff but i think it's cool it does have the old school throat mic or the it goes around your neck kind of like a choker so also knows a black belt and uh he, you know what, I'll leave that joke for another time, but it's a cool device. I like it. We got a little earpiece in here so I can pick up on other stuff that people are saying back. And you can zip this up and hide it. But yeah, cool old piece of technology. I just wanted to like showcase that to you guys a bit. If you've never heard about it, well, congratulations, now you have. And it's cool, cool old, old school technology. But yeah, ultimately that's all I wanted to talk to you guys about. And uh, yeah, so... I still have one. I don't use it terribly often because I like shouting and being loud while I'm playing airsoft, but if you were more inclined to be on the sneaky sneak, there's this, and I hope there's been improvements to the technology over the years where you get a more expensive, more useful one that comes across way clearer, and maybe it's a bit easier to use. But yeah, that's all I really wanted to talk to you guys about. Just gonna showcase this. It's nifty when we actually take this off real quick so you guys get an idea. See, so yeah, there's just a bunch of Velcro. Let's slide that off there. Ugh. You can take it all the way off, but yeah, as you can see, there's the pickup. And there's a little cable I got going to the PTT. There's another pickup over here. Supposedly, this is adjustable. This right here is your wire keeper. That keeps the wire safe. Actually, you know what? I could totally just crunch that down, couldn't I? Looks like I'd be able to crunch it. But yeah, and there's your other pickup. And there's your little earpiece, the other neck bar. That's all there is to it. Just a little pickup, you hold that to your throat, and you go, can you guys hear me? As you can see, as you get farther away from the voice box, it gets dimmer, but cool piece of technology. And yeah, now you guys know that it's a thing, and it exists. They're nifty. If you're buying one on Amazon, uh, good luck. Like I said, with there being so many, there's a lot of companies making trash ones, and there's like one or two companies making good ones. So uh, best of luck, read the reviews, and um, hopefully you don't get shafted by China. So cheers everyone, and uh, have an outstanding Chivalrous Day. Peace.